today we are reviewing Tyco trains. They're about as dead as Ohio Rail. Oh, by the way, subscribe to Young Indian on YouTube. Let's get on with it. This, the, the Tyco is one of those model train companies, used to be one of those model train companies that would slap a, uh, a really well-known railroad on a car and paint it whatever the railroad engines were. Let's say, okay, we'll take the Conrail cars example that I've, hopefully that was an accident broke. Roll the clip. Whoops. Oh no. Anyways, these Tyco made in China uh, air polluted cars were made by them and they're not accurate. They're more for kids to just yeet like I did before. Um, the, I have a couple of these and I have a whole train of those. See, if you could, these are the trains you would find in a yard sale mostly that don't work. Garbage. Don't work. This doesn't work, but this does. I have two of them. This one's a bit better. That This one doesn't even have handrails. So we're going to review. I don't know what to do with oh, this. Oh. Oops. Anyways. So, metal handrails. That's good. These are more durable. I can't push them. Um, horns are in the wrong place. They need to be back here, boy. And they're yellow. What is that? Is that a Nathan? Some kind of Nathan something. I can't even tell. And it must be Norfolk Southern because they have the headlights on the top instead of the bottom. This number plate's coming off a bit. There's supposed to be lights here, but they just made them little, I don't know, nose. And it's an Alco, that's for sure. These bulbs more than likely don't work. I haven't ran this thing. And the thing about Tyco is when you run it, when you run at one of these engines, it's gonna smell like the uh, batteries. Yay! Cause that's always nice. How to air pollute your house? Tyco trains. Hopefully you got Febreze, not sponsored. No numbers except for the 4301. Actually, does this one have the 3301? Yes, it does. Same engine. And even though it's 1776, they don't take time. These are made in China. But you got the other brands, which we'll get back into in Randy's uh, sarcastic vintage train reviews. Um, not accurate. They never had cabooses like these. Very kind of durable plastic. Wheels more than likely. If you find these at yard sale, more than likely they won't have the wheels or couplers. And they, or if you drop them even accidentally, they'll just break off like that. We already rolled that clip. Now, this, this is accurate. This is okay. I mean, when you go to a yard sale and you'll find people tamper with these and put weights in them, I hate that. Because then you got, then you got, uh, sounds like these. Roll the clip. Anyways, yeah. Um, hopefully that clip was played. This, like I said, they'll slap paint schemes on stuff. Well, come back next time where we review Lifelike. Only if Young Indian approves, though. Because, like, I'm going to shout him out in every video. I need him to comment saying he approves. Okay. Hey, roll the... Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the... <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Top of his head! <laughs>